Race you to the raft. Ready, go. Look at the clouds, Emily. They look so beautiful, Little Bear. I think I see a giant woolly beetle. Where? Right above us. You mean the one that looks like an Indian chief? <laughs> That's not an Indian chief. Now it looks like a ballerina. It looks more like an elephant to me. <laughs> <laughs> Duck, can you see the one I mean? Um, the big goose eggy one? <laughs> no, it's a beautiful big castle. Cat, hen, owl, it's such a hot day. Why don't you come out here on the raft? I can't swim. I can swim if I have to, but I don't have to. I'm quite comfortable where I am, thank you. Little bear, little bear. Quack. Uh, oh dear. Don't we need this for something? Maybe we should swim back to shore. No, this will be fun. Here. Put this on. What about you? I'm a bear. I practically live in the water. Oh, well. Little bear, where are you going? We're going rafting on the river, I guess. That river's too slow. You'll be drifting forever. You'll never make it back in time for lunch. Oh, yes, we will. We'll race you to the big tree. A race? How exciting. On your marks, get set, go! go! We're already going! Woo! <laughs> Come on, Owl. <gasps> the others are ahead of us. Can we go faster, Little Bear? Uh, uh, I'm trying. Uh. Uh. Run! <laughs> <laughs> Look, we're already way ahead of them. I knew that river was slow. And I know a shortcut. Follow me. This is so lovely. Oh, little bear, isn't rafting wonderful? Uh, oh, yes. Wonderful. Oh! Ah! Little bear, what are you doing? I got the pole stuck. Oh, my. How can we go faster without the pole? Uh, I don't think we can. We'll just have to go where the river takes us. I'm not too fond of your shortcuts, Cat. Oh, come on, it'll be fine. <laughs> Whoa! Some shortcut that was. The others are ahead of us now. I'm tired. There were so many branches and thorns. We just went in a big circle. It was a very good shortcut. You two just didn't go fast enough, that's all. Oh, oh dear. Uh... Oh, oh. oh! Rocks? Uh, uh... We're really 
stuck. We're going to win this race very easily. Maybe we should have a rest. After all, it is very hot. Ah, that's much better. Uh, uh, we're going uh, to lose the race if we don't get going. Uh, and miss lunch. Hello, little bear. Emily? Duck, it's the otters. Hello, otters. What are you doing on this beautiful day? Come in for a swim. Well, that would be nice, but we're in the middle of a race. A race? Don't you think you should pick up the pace? Well, yes, but we're stuck on this rock. Don't worry. We'll get you unstuck. With, With a, a flip, flip and a flap. flap. Oh, what wonderful swimmers they are. Thank you, otters. You're welcome. But this is going to take you all day. We can show you a faster way. Uh-oh. Hold on tight. Hold on to your hat. I don't have a hat. What? Yeah! 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 Uh-oh. Look, the others are way ahead of us. However did they do that? Come on, we have to hurry. <laughs> Look, little bear, there's the big tree. We're almost there. Thank you, otters. That was a wonderful ride. Goodbye, little bear. See you later. Glad to help. Again. There's the raft. We've caught up to them. Can we slow down now? No, no, we're almost there. Look, I can see the big tree. If we go the long way around, we'll never win the race. Hmm, we need a shortcut. Not another one of your shortcuts. Look! If Owl can get that rope, we can swing over to the other side. We won't even get our feet wet. I can! I, I can't see! Look! It's Cat and Hen and Owl! <coughs> Whoa! <coughs> 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 I don't like swimming. Neither do I. And we've lost the race. No, you haven't. It's a tie, because we've all finished together. Watch this, Grandfather Bear. I'm watching. Goodbye. Where do you think they're going? Wherever the wind takes them. There's a lot of wind today. Yes, it's a wonderful day for flying a kite. If we had a kite. We can make one. We can? Let's do it. Now, you take the two sticks and make a T. Like this. A small T. Oh. Perfect. Now we can tie them with a string. Can I tie them? Okay. I'll hold the stick. You take the string and wrap it over and under. Okay. Over and under. Over and under. Over and under there. Oops. I think I'm too big to fly. <laughs> <laughs> Let's start over. This is going to be the best kite ever. Yep. Let's glue on the paper. <sighs> Oops. Look out, Grandfather. You're getting glue on you. Oh, just a little. Oh. 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 Now 
now you're getting gluey. Just a little. How's this? Looks good and sticky to me. Oh. <laughs> oh. I'll get it. Uh, uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, my. We better wash our hands. Good idea. Let's get the paper on before the glue dries. Press down hard. <clears throat> what do you think? Hmm. I think it needs something. Okay. Hmm. Very good. That looks like you. It is me. If I'm on the kite, I can look down and see the whole world. Can we fly it now? <laughs> well, now, there's one thing missing. The tail. What color should the tail be? I love red. How about some yellow? Mother Bear's favorite color is blue, and Father Bear likes orange. That's not quite long enough yet. Maybe with this green piece? Hmm, do we have any purple? Purple. There. Look, Grandfather Bear, I've got a rainbow for a tail. Yes, it's a beautiful kite. Now, let's see if it flies. Here I go. Whoa! Ah, ooh. I think this is a job for two bears. I'll hold the kite, you run. But first, we need a good high spot to launch it from. Ready? Set? Go! Now, Grandfather Bear! It's up! It's up! It's up! It's a beauty. Let out the string. Give it some more. Well, looks like you've got it under control. I'll just uh, rest for a minute. Don't let out too much string. You never know where that kite might take you. Could I go anywhere in the world? If the string was long enough. Interesting. There's another kite. Come on. Let's see who it is. Emily. Hi, little bear. Oh, oh. Let's fly our kites together. 
I love your kite, little bear. It looks just like you. Thanks, Emily. How far do you think they'll go if we let out all the string? A long, long way. Do you think they could go to the moon? Maybe. You never know where your kite might take you. Father Bear, when will Mother Bear be home? Oh, I'm sure she's on her way home now. Perhaps you should be getting ready for bed. Mother Bear didn't kiss me goodnight. Yes, she did. I saw her. That was a kiss goodbye, not goodnight. I'm always ready for bed after my goodnight kiss. All right, then. Why don't I read you a story while we wait for Mother Bear to return? Would you like that? <laughs> What would you like me to read tonight? The Night of the Full Moon. This one again? I like monster stories. So do I. Can we read the book outside? Why? If there are any monsters outside, they can hear this story too. Good idea. It's getting dark. There isn't much light for reading books. Fireflies, can you help us with our storybook? Don't worry, I'll let you out as soon as Father Bear is finished reading. Father Bear, do you think the monsters are out? They must still be sleeping. They only come out when there's a full moon. Oh yes, that's right. Now let's see. Two little... Monsters! <laughs> Two little monsters on the moon. Dance while a comet whistles a tune. One goes up and then goes down. The other moon monster goes round and round. One moon monster jumps over tall trees. The other one crawls on his hands and knees. One scares himself. And bumps his head. The other one says, you should go to bed. Not yet. <laughs> <laughs> ah, guess what we have tonight? A full moon. It's beautiful. It's almost like daytime. It is indeed. Grr, grr, the full moon is out. You know what that means. What? It's time for the moon monsters to go out and play. Should we hide from them? No, we are them. Grr. Come on, Father Moon Monster. Where are we going, little moon monster? Two little monsters on the moon. Dance, Dance while, while a, a comet, comet whistles, whistles a tune. tune. <laughs> One monster goes up. A father moon monster and a little moon monster together make a very big moon monster. <laughs> One monster then goes down. down. One monster goes over and then around. Are you the little monster that likes to crawl on his hands and knees? Yep. Moon monster. <laughs> monster bumps his head. One monster scares himself, then bumps his head. <laughs> Two little monsters on the moon dance while a comet whistles a tune. <laughs> little monster, I forgot a line from the book. 
Little Moon Monster gets very sleepy. Father Bear, that's not in the book. It's not? No. <sighs> we have company, Little Moon Monster. certainly are. Are you scared? Ooh, terrified. Grr, and I'm a father moon monster. Oh my. We make trouble wherever we go. Why aren't you in bed like all good little monsters? Moon monsters don't sleep when there's a full moon. <sighs> Not even when they're sleepy? Sleepy monsters can't go to sleep without a good night kiss. Hmm. So what you monsters really want is another kiss from the mother monster. Yes, that's right. But you'll have to catch me first. <laughs> well then, here comes mother monster. <laughs> <laughs> Will a goodnight kiss change the little monster back into my little bear? Uh-huh. Why, it is my little bear. Now father monster, too. <coughs> Welcome back, father bear. Now it's time for bed. Yes, all the monsters are sleeping now. Good night, my little bear. <coughs> 